with Microsoft SQL Server, not only can you work with business intelligence, but you can also provide data related to data mining. So what's the difference? Business intelligence tells you what's going on in your company. Data mining, on the other hand, looks for patterns in the data. So you have two options when data mining. You can work with Visual Studio, and this is the cut down version of Visual Studio that comes with your SQL Server license. It's BIDS, Business Intelligence Development Studio. A cut down version of Visual Studio that comes with SQL Server. We'll have a quick look at a data mining model. Uh, before we go on briefly, you can also, your second option regarding data mining is working with Excel. There's a data mining add in for SQL Server available for free that comes with Excel. Now it only works with the 32 bit version of Excel, but it's there. And the reason why it works with the 32 bit is due to the dependency on Office Web Apps. So now back to data mining in Visual Studio. SQL Server supports nine different algorithms. And I'll just show you briefly the, the list of them there, association rules, clustering, decision trees, and so on. That's all nine. I'm gonna show you now association algorithm and the forecasting algorithm. So we'll start with the association algorithm that SQL Server supports. And by processing car sales data from the, this fictional brand and consulting car sales company, if we look at the association rules, if we apply the association data mining algorithm to that data, we can start seeing some patterns. So if I just filter on name only, the most important pattern actually is this. Every time a C190 Mercedes and an E220 Mercedes is sold, this one was also sold at some point. Again, let's pick another pattern down along here. Every time a Punto ST was sold and a Panda 1.6, this type of Fiat Punto was also sold. So what you're seeing here is the association rules algorithm being used for data mining on this car sales data. Um, another example would be, let's see, it could be interesting. A lot of Honda, Honda Accord Saloon. Every time this Honda Accord Saloon was sold, so was, and this one, this one was also. So you can see combinations within the data. And that could be useful for stock control, uh, predicting and forecasting. The second algorithm I'm going to show you now that SQL Server supports is forecasting. This is two of nine I'm going to demo to you. This is the forecasting algorithm and I'm going to click on the mining model viewer. Again, the data has already been prepared and already been processed and these are the results. And again, you can view this data in, you can carry out the data mining in Excel or this cut down version of Visual Studio that comes with SQL Server. And that's what I'm using now, the cut down version of, SQL, of Visual Studio that comes with your SQL Server license. And this is the forecasting model. So we'll just look at Fiat data only. And we can see this is what actually happened up to, he, up to this point here. After this, you're getting into forecasting. And you can also say, well, based on data to date if you had done any previous forecasting what would what would you have said would have happened so you click here and the forecasting algorithm would have predicted the following that sales would have dropped off here and and kind of leveled out that's not what happened but there's not much data behind this the more data you have regarding data mining the better the more the better it's always the case as regards data mining And you can also say, well, that's five prediction steps into the future. What about six prediction steps and seven prediction steps and so on? So based on the data, this is how it sees things going, the forecasting model. In order to optimize your data mining, again, looking for patterns, you got to have an awful lot of data. The more data, the better. That's the key to it all. And that's it. That's data mining in Microsoft SQL Server in a nutshell. Can be done using Visual Studio or can be done using Microsoft Excel.